Hello everybody and welcome back to another short bit segment from IG Apps where today I'll be covering how to set the visibility of views in both XML and Java. In a previous video I also covered how to add images and sound to your app so I recommend that you check those videos before coming here. Now let's get started. So over here in Android Studio I have my app and then I have this app open over here on the side with Captain America's shield and what I'm going to do in this video is show you how to set the view visibility to either one of view, uh, visible, invisible, or gone, and I'll explain what those are. But you don't need to have an image view. Any view should work um, uh, fine, like a button or anything else that you want to use. So uh, in order to set the visibility to XML, we're going to say Android visibility, and then we can set it like that. And that's one of the attributes that all views have. So what visible does is obviously it sets the view to visible. That way you can see it and interact with it. What invisible does is it sets it so that you can't see it or interact with it, but the view is still there. And later on, if you wanted, you could set it back to visible. On the other hand, gone is similar to invisible in that you can't see it or use it. However, it completely removes the view. So once you set the uh, visibility to gone, you can't use that view anymore because it doesn't exist. And that's how you do it in XML. And now I'm going to show you how to do it in Java, and then I'll run it in my app to show you that it works. I have my image view object over here. And once again, you can use any um, type of view that you want. And I have an on touch listener. That way I'm going to change the visibility when the button's clicked. And then what I'm going to type is IMG, which is my object for the image view, dot set visibility. And I'm going to say view, uh, sorry, with the capital V, view dot. And then I can say invisible or visible or gone. And for now, I'm just going to say view dot invisible. And you have to make sure that's all in caps. And now that my view is set to invisible, I'm going to run the app and show you that my view, that Captain America shield is not visible. So here I have my app open with Captain America Shield. And what I'm going to do is click on it. And you can see that it disappeared immediately. And that's because we set it to invisible. So this was just a basic tutorial on how to set the visibility of your views in both XML and Java. And it's fairly easy because all you have to do in XML is say Android visibility. And Java, you have to say dot set visibility. That's all for this short bit segment. And I know it was rather short because the concept was simple. Please share the channel with friends and subscribe because your support is very much welcome. In a future short bit segment, I will cover how to programmatically change the image as being displayed in an imagery. That way you can alternate between two images. Until then, happy developing from IG Apps.